It's your boy Tcraft97 back again with another video. This time we're playing some Minecraft. And we're gonna do something a little different that I haven't done yet on this channel. So uh, what we're gonna do is we're going to be doing a tutorial video. And as you guys can tell of what this title is and uh, what I'm in right now, we're gonna be showing you guys how to do this little house here that I did. So I got all the materials that you're going to need, the exact number in that chest right over there. So, um, before we get into that, I would like to thank everybody so much for subscribing with the bell on. So that way you guys can enjoy my content and come back for, for future videos and daily live streams. Also, I wanted also to say a shout out to my friends. They all are doing so good on YouTube as well. Check them out. Links are in the description. So be sure to check that out. Also, there's going to be a little clip on screen right now of each of their channels. that being said yeah guys uh, I hope you guys enjoy all of our contents to come and uh, yeah we're hopefully going to be doing some more games and uh, who knows we might do other stuff too depends on like what you guys want so let us know what you're interested in us seeing and yeah I mean so this is a small little simple survival minecraft house made out of entirely out of wood uh, different types of wood. There's a furnace and craft table and bed and thing too that you're going to need. But yeah, uh, we're cl so close to 4,000 subscribers on YouTube. And once we hit 5,000 subscribers, I'm going to be doing a little video celebrating and giving back to the community on that. So uh, yeah, I mean, it's I've got big plans for this channel. It's that we need help from you guys, uh, the viewers. So be sure to make sure you subscribe with the bell on so you don't miss another daily live stream that I do and videos. I don't post them daily. I post them maybe once a week. Depends on how my computer does. I haven't been doing much right now because that's been messing up. But that's a whole other story. Um, I'll talk about that on the live stream that I do. But yeah, with that being said, guys, um, thank you guys so much, and yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's all going to be in survival only, because I know how there's a lot of people who do tutorial videos, they don't do it in survival. Uh, I'm not going to be like one of them. I'm going to do all my tutorial videos in survival, show you guys exactly how many blocks you're going to need, and how to build it in survival. So, with that being said, yeah guys, let's jump right into this video. First things first. You're going to want to find your area where you're going to build it and grab your materials. Materials are exact count in this chest. Feel free to pause the video right now as I go through it. So first things first, you're going to want to grab 75 oak planks, 67 oak logs, 47 dark oak logs, 18 oak wood stairs, 17 oak wood slabs, 16 spruce wood slabs, 11 oak fences, and one oak door these stuff down here are all optional you don't need them but I would recommend them if you're going to be living in this area so two chests for a double chest a crafting table a furnace a bed and a 14 torches so now with that being said what you want to do is go to where you're building it I'm gonna build it right next to this one um, we'll build it right behind it so you want to find yourself a seven by nine area and in that seven by nine area what you want to do is you want to place a block right there so that it's your corner block um, your corner block so you can have the dark oak log facing outward like this towards you just like so and then what you want to do is grab three oak logs oh uh, let's uh make it even with that because that's gonna mess me up sorry about that guys so uh like i said place your dark oak log facing outward just like so you can come behind and delete this block that was just so you can place it like that then grab two 
start uh, two oak logs just like so. The reason why we need to do that is because all our oak logs are going to be facing the same way. So then two oak logs and then a dark oak and then two more oak logs and then a dark oak just like so. And then come around to the back of the building. Do one, two, three oak logs, a dark oak log, but you don't want to face in that way, sorry. You want it to be facing this way, just like that. You can place a wood oak wood plank here because uh, we're going to be needing it. Um, you'll see why. So just leave it if you place it. Then one, two, three more oak logs. Then uh, you can place another oak log, uh, oak plank, just like so. I mean, you don't need to right now, but you can. Go ahead and then do one, two oak logs, one, and then one, two, and then one. That's kind of dangerous right there, what I did. And then on this front, you want to go one, two, three out with that. You can place your oak wood plank and place the dark oak log just like so. Now, the reason why I said you can uh, leave these two like that is because you want to grab your oak wood planks and fill in just like I'm doing right here on only the blocks that are by the wood. Don't do all the other ones. You want to have it looking something like this and then grab your door. You can place your door right there. Make sure it's looking good just like that and then uh, actually sorry guys you don't want your, ah, I should have grabbed a shovel but oh well, it looks like we're doing this by hand so dig out all this now and replace with spruce wood planks all 16 spruce wood planks that I said you're going to need is going to be for the flooring right here so let's just mine this out do, 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 do. all right now that we got that grab all 16 spruce wood planks that you grabbed and just fill this all in and you should run out of spruce wood planks if you grab the right amount. And then you can place your oak wood uh, door just like so. And then what you want to do, hop up here and place another layer of your oak wood planks just like this. Fill it in one higher on this so it all connects just like that. Grab your dark oak logs, place a dark oak log facing upward on each of these dark oak logs that you placed already. Just like so. Careful to not fall in the hole if you're building a new one like I am. Then grab your oak wood slabs and just fill it in in between each dark oak log on top of the oak logs that you placed earlier. Just like this. And you should run out as well then what you want to do is grab your oak wood planks once more and just go up another layer except on these corner pieces right here you'll want to leave blank delete that block okay. you'll want to leave this one blank because we're going to be placing something there so there should be three holes just like that when you get done with that okay now what you want to do is uh, actually grab your dark oak logs and fill in once more with ones facing up. Hopefully no mobs come at me when I'm doing this because that's going to be fun. We'll leave that one. Oh god. I feel like I'm going to get wrecked by a mob. <sighs> Dang. So it should be looking something like this. But we got to figure out where I lay up there now. Well, if you fall, guys, you're going to have to delete a block so you can get back up there. Anyways, so now that we came back up here, you want to, like I said, place just like so. And then with these empty holes right here, you'll want to grab your fences and place one in each of them holes just like that. And then place another layer of oak planks just like this. And you should... If you count it correctly, run out of your oak wood log, uh, oak wood planks. Just be careful not to fall, because then you'll have to delete just like me to get back up, and it's not fun. 
I guess that's kind of why they, all them others, do this on creative, so in case they fall or anything. But, anyways, I'm not going to be like that. So, now that you have it looking like this, what you'll want to do is you'll want to place a oak log, just like that. Just for now, just for now. So you can place your dark oak logs outward like that. Then you can go ahead and delete this piece. Make sure you grab it so you don't have to fall down. One, two. Just like the bottom, you're going to do one, two, and then an oak, a dark oak log. And then you'll want to go one, two more. And then your dark oak log again, just like so. And then turn and do one, two, three. And then one. And then uh, one, two, three. That's the only difference from this one to the last one is you're going to actually be doing that on this side now. So place a placeholder block there to place it so you can do it like that. And delete this block. Make sure you catch it. But don't fall like I did because then you'll have to get back up. And yeah. So place it like that. And then uh, oak logs, two. Then a dark oak log, just like that. Then two oak logs, your dark oak log, you'll want to place it just like so. And then just fill this in with oak logs. One, two, three. And then a dark oak log, like that. And then one, two, three. So it should be so looking something like this now. We're going layer by layer as you guys can tell, so that way it's easier to build. Then grab your oak wood stairs and place them on each piece of dark oak log on this long sides like this. So you'll want to place a total of six. Make sure you don't fall because it's a pain getting back up here and it takes damage. Then once you have that, place two dark oak logs right there, two right here, and two right there. Then, what you want to do is grab your oak logs and just connect them, just like so. Connect the two long sides, just like this. Then, grab three oak fences, place them right on that side, three on this side, one on the middle of each one. And that should run you out of all your fences. Then you'll want to jump place a stair on each one of these dark oak logs again, just like so. And we got a little zombie friend out there, so be sure to not get caught by him, because that won't be fun. Was it a zombie? No, it was a sheep. Alright, so you'll want to place them on each of these, just like this. And, yep, don't do that, because that was not fun. Because now I have to break these to get back up there. Okay. Now that we're back up here, uh, place uh, your stairs on each one of these. Then, once again, do exactly what you did on the bottom one, just like this. Place dark oak uh, logs on each of these pieces of stairs that you placed. Just like so. Make sure they're all facing inward. And don't fall again like I did. Because literally now I have to build back up. So now that you're back up here, if you do fall like I did, you'll want to grab more oak wood log. Place one more there. And just repeat the process again. Stairs on each one of these oak logs, just like I'm doing. And if you grab the right amount of oak wood stairs, you should run out of them. Just like this. So, try not to fall like me. Yep, okay. Alright. So, try not falling like I did numerous times. I cut that out of the video because, well, it literally happened to me like five times in a row, so... Um, yeah, so once you get those done, you should run out of those. Place your dark oak logs in the middle, just like that again. 
and then grab your oak wood logs and fill in the gaps just like this being sure not to fall because it wastes time and it also does damage to you guys so then when you do that you should run out of all the material then you can fall down if you are still got some hearts left uh, we're gonna fill this in with some dirt and everything because we don't want it near our house um, and then what you want to do from here is grab your other optional materials that I said oh I have 16 dirt let's fill this in real quick all right so grab your other optional materials and what you'll do is place a torch on each of these blocks just like so That's the reason why I said you'll need 14 of them. After the outside, you should have two of them done. Left. Place them right there and right there. And then when you're in here, you can place your bed and stuff however you like. But I like to place my stuff just like this. It gives the most room out of this. And voila, you guys have completed a simple survival house made out of wood. So. That's what it should look like from the inside, and this is what it should look like from the outside, just like this. So, with that being said, yeah guys, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, subscribe with the bell on if you haven't already, and make sure you like the video. Comment down below if you enjoyed it, and what you want me to build next, and I'll see you guys on my next daily live stream, and in my next Minecraft tutorial video. Uh, one quick final thing. I do want to say that we are probably going to be making this into a big giant city. So uh, if you guys want that to happen, be sure to like the video and subscribe with the bell on so you don't miss when I do that. Uh, I'm probably going to be playing this on survival on streams um, just so we can do more stuff in here. And I might be doing tutorial videos on there too. And then editing that into normal videos. So if you want to watch me do a live uh, tutorial video, be sure to subscribe and everything. Uh, also check the links down below for uh, check the links in the description down below for my friends' channels as well as on screen right now. So with that being said, yeah guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, and it's your boy Tcraft97 signing off with another Minecraft video. Bye.